Hello everyone, my name is Julian. I'm the founder of Notion Forms and today I'm going to show you how to get started with the tool. So the first thing to do is to create an account. You can go to notionforms.io slash register or just click the create form button to find the register page. You just fill this little form, you hit register and then you just need to connect your Notion account with your Notion Forms account. This essentially allows us to interact with, that, with your databases, find the structure inside Notion, and put the form submission back to your Notion database. So to do this, you just need to hit the button Login with Notion. This opens a new tab here. And you can select the workspace you want to work with. So I want to go with that one. And then I can hit Select Pages. Uh, you can select the pages you want to share with Notion Forms. For now, I'm just going to go and click them all like it was. And finally, I'm going to click Allow Access. I should, yeah, boom, it's done. So now my Notion workspace is shared with Notion Forms and I can see all of the database I have created already. Now that the setup is done, we can go ahead and create our first form. The first thing to do is to create a first database. I already have one, uh, which is really simple. It's provided by default by Notion, and it has two main columns. The first one is the name uh, of the task, and the second one is the status of the task. So let's create a form to quickly input some data uh, into this Notion database. So I just go back to Notion Forms, and here I can select the task database. Uh, if I have many database, I can also search for it, and I can just click here. I'll skip the tool for now, but you can see we have two inputs in the form that, are, that has been created, one for the name and one for the status, and it comes with the right selection option. So I can, you know, uh, change the title of the form. I can call it add a task. I can add a small description to it. Uh, let's complete all my tasks and many other options that you can find here. Uh, we do have a huge help center with many articles to explain how the different options work, but I'm going to keep it simple for now, and I'm just going to create the form. Okay, so it's done. So now I can click this link and I can see the form. So if I tap name uh, by groceries, let's say, and the status is to do, that's my new task. I can just hit submit. And then you can see it's submitted. And now if I go back to my Notion, you can see that the task just appear. It's that simple. If you want to share the form, you can just copy that link here and you know send it in an email or you know via WhatsApp, whatever. But something cool that you can also do is that you can embed the form back into your Notion workspace. So uh, let's say I create a new page where I can put my form, I just need to paste the form URL and then click create embed. And then you can see that my forms appears right into Notion, which is really cool because I can also fill it. So task example, pick another status, hit submit. And again, if we go back to our task list, it appears here as well. So that's really convenient. That's all, the form is created. Please feel free to reach out if you need any help. You can click this little button here and talk to us. Uh, we'll be happy to help you. I hope that was useful. Have a good day. Bye.